yo, what's up everybody? It's B Militant. Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host here on the Redskins Review. Um, and today I'm going to be making a video about what I want the Washington Redskins to do in the NFL Draft coming up this Thursday. But first I want to make a video about something that I've seen so much stuff about and I just think people aren't ready for what might be the biggest shocker of this uh, NFL Draft, which is I think Kyler Murray might not go number one overall. Um, you know, if you pay attention to all these mock drafts and just anyone talking about the draft, um, the big consensus is that Kyler Murray is going to go number one to the Arizona Cardinals. Um, and especially because they have their new coach, uh, Cliff Kingsbury. But to me, um, I feel like it, obviously, sure, that might happen. And that's that's no shocker. But I'm just saying that I have a feeling that they might not go after Kyler Murray uh, for multiple reasons. And that's basically, it comes down to the reason that I think that this is going to happen and that I'm not going to be shocked by this. And some, a lot of people are probably going to be shocked by this because a lot of people just listen to, you know, what all the people in the mock drafts have to say and stuff like that. And just anyone you hear will say that uh, Kyler Murray is going to go number one overall. Um, and if you just think about it and you just pay attention to um, the NFL and how organizations work, one thing that I've learned uh, is that organizations do not like to admit guilt or that they've done something wrong. Last year, the Cardinals went up and drafted uh, Josh Rosen, uh, I think 10th overall. They moved up. They traded to move up in the draft to, to draft this kid. And now they're going to have a new coach and everything this year. But to me, I feel like this new coach, he probably got this job off of trying to sell that he can run whatever offense he wants to run with the guy that they just moved up to trade up to get and I understand Josh Rosen didn't play well last year but also Josh uh, Rosen is young and he still has talent you know that he can play well you know we've seen him play well before um, just not in the NFL yet and also the thing is the whole entire Cardinals team uh, didn't play well so um, sitting here and just going after another quarterback who is you know he could be an upgrade, but there's 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 ups ups and downs when it comes to Kyler Murray. So I don't see uh, the Cardinals going and one admitting guilt. Hey, we we moved up and we traded up to get this guy. We thought he was going to be the guy, and the very next year just ditching him and saying, hey, we screwed up and we're going to go get this guy because we're going to be right this time. Organizations don't like to admit that they were wrong. Um, you see this all the time, and I'll use a Redskins example. Um, what was it, the AAF or whatever, the AFL, whatever the hell that was called, that they had a brief stint where they had a bunch of uh, prior NFL players and, you know, people who inspired aspired to be in the NFL and stuff like that were playing in this league recently. And uh, there was a guy, Rashad Rocket Ross, who was a Redskin, and he was basically a wide receiver who just had um, a ton of speed and we he was on the Redskins for maybe a cu just a couple years, and we let him go, and then he went to this AAF or whatever, uh, and he blew up. He was doing very well. He was uh, at all, like all the highlights that I was watching, um, you know, that I saw on YouTube. Whenever I just randomly came across it, it was a lot of uh, Rashad Ross highlights. He was doing very well, and guess what? The Redskins have a huge need. A huge need at wide receiver. But were we going to go pick up the guy that we dropped a couple years back? No. You know why we're, we didn't? Because that would mean that we were wrong and we're admitting that we were wrong and organizations just don't do this. Whether it's the right thing or, or, or not. I'm not saying uh, drafting Kyler Murray is the right or wrong thing. I'm just saying I'm not going to be shocked when um, the Cardinals take uh, Nick Bosa or Quinnen Williams at number one and not um Kyler Murray so that's pretty much that's it for this video I mean you see this stuff all the time um organizations just kind of run this way and I could like I said I could be wrong everyone thinks Kyler Murray is going to go number one uh maybe some people have insider information and you know I don't know what the hell I'm talking about all I'm saying is I'm not going to be shocked if Kyler Murray doesn't go number one and then the entire draft changes and is just thrown you know, off just polar shifts differently um, compared to how everyone and everyone that's talking about it thinks it's going to go. 
So that's it for this video. Um, there will be another video today about the Redskins. So if you're a Redskins fan, see you then. Peace.